The KZN Future 50 with Pavlo Fatidis. Inspiring KZN's business future. It is time for KZN Future 50. And for that, we have Pavlo Fatidis from Auric. Morning, Pavlo. Good morning, team. So, which business are we featuring today and why did we pick them? We're going to be featuring Sean Grinick's business called Green Hill Laboratories. And what they do, it's a testing, production and consulting laboratory across the agriculture, or food, healthcare, hospitality, pharmaceutical and veterinary industry. And the reason we picked them is because it's a fantastically simple business to build if you have a doctorate in biochemistry and molecular biology and also a master's in animal sciences. It is the right end spectrum of true, true science and science-based businesses hold and contain so much intellectual capital. We should be supporting them, nurturing them, growing them in order to build out that economy across our country. So Pavlo, what makes Green Hill Laboratories special enough to be on the KZN Future 50? So Carmen, I'm going I'm to answer you with a question. If you had no choice, right? If I would literally said to you, you have to do this or the world will implode, your loved ones will all die and there, there are no options. And the decision I gave you is right now, you either lick your cell phone or you lick the toilet seat mm. at ECR. I'll go with my cell phone. <laughs> uh, I'll go with the toilet seat. <laughs> Wise choice, Darren, because what Sean will be able to show you is in understanding how to measure bacteria and germ counts across the dairy industry, the aquaculture industry, across medical devices used in surgery, abattoirs, pharmaceutical companies, in transport and packaging, in food processing plants. There are more germs on a cell phone than there are on the average toilet seat. And this really matters when it comes to producing food quality or producing safety in the medicines and food products that we eat and drink day in and day out. It is an important business and it is a business that needs to go beyond just simply making us safe because in it lies the opportunity to help its clients improve productivity and compete more globally. Pavlo, where will Green Hill Laboratories be in five years? So, Darren, it's what's interesting about this this business, it's in a very concentrated industry. And, and what I mean by that is that there are very few players. And the reasons are because you need a very high degree of skill and specialization. There are big barriers to entry. In other words, to start a business like this is not easy because you need eye-wateringly expensive equipment and measuring equipment and mixers and agitators. These labs are not simple. And what we find is that there's some very big established players in the market that own big challenges of this industry and Sean's opportunity to grow normally only occurs when those providers, his competitors, mess up with their clients. Then they come to him and he then builds his business off the back of it. And I think what we need to do is go beyond that because waiting for growth as opposed to enabling and making it happen is the key to unlock the future for this particular Green Hill Laboratories. And the way to make that happen is know who your customer is. And in his case, it's quality managers. And as important as they are, they're very often not considered as essential to a business or key to a business's success by necessarily the CEOs of the big corporates or the financial officers of the big corporates who see them as an important but compliance-driven cost in the business. If Sean's able to, for example, go and visit quality managers, encourage them to have the CEO there, the finance people there, the production people there, the operations people there, and do a test there and then on the cell phones and on the toilet seats and help them understand and experience where germs reside and how germs hide, it opens a door for a commercial conversation where beyond looking at quality, Sean can talk to them about how to improve their production processes, their operating processes and become an essential and valuable partner to them. Pavlo Fatidis from Orica joining us again for another KZN Future 50. Thank you, Pavlo. Thank you, team. Thank you. So, listen, if you want to get involved in any KZN Future 50, just go to ecr.co.za. There you can find information on all the companies that are featured.